How to add a PayPal Pay Now button onto your app pages. This feature allows anyone with a PayPal account to add a PayPal payment button anywhere on their app. A couple of important notes before we start. The feature is only available for app owners who are using the member login functionality, and the app owner needs a business account with PayPal in order to use this feature. Start by going to the PayPal settings menu item under the build section. You'll see that you need two codes from your PayPal account, the sandbox ID and the production ID. You should get these from your PayPal account. If you already have a business PayPal account, skip this step. But if not, go to paypal.com, click on sign up, and click on business account. Complete the steps. Otherwise, simply log in to your PayPal business account. Next, go to PayPal's developer dashboard at developer.paypal.com slash developer slash applications. The link is also available in the description of this YouTube video. Click on My Apps and Credentials. You'll see a screen with a toggle button with the options Sandbox and Live. Start with Sandbox. Click on Create App. Enter a name for your app, and then click on Create App again. You'll see Sandbox API credentials appear. The client ID on this screen is the Sandbox ID you need on your Beezer platform. Go ahead and copy it and paste it into the appropriate field on your Beezer platform. Next, go back to My Apps and API Credentials on your PayPal Developer Dashboard. This time, choose the Live toggle at the top instead of Sandbox. Again, click on Create App, name your app, and click Create again. This time, you will see your live API credentials, in other words, your production credentials. Copy this client ID and paste it into the production ID field on your Beezer platform. Once you've pasted those IDs, you can set the currency in which you want to charge your payments. You can also choose to turn on payment history for your users. Make sure you click on Save. Now, you need to decide which page you want to add the payment Pay Now button onto. Go to the Build section of your platform, go to the desired page or create a new page, and click on the plus button to add a new component. From our list of components, scroll down until you find the Pay Now component. Choose it and add it to the app. Now, simply specify the price of the product or service being sold. And don't forget to publish your app. Now that you've done this, your app users will be able to pay for your product or service using this Pay Now button on your app. click to pay, they will get the option to either log in to their own PayPal account and pay with that, or to check out as a guest using a credit card or debit card through PayPal.